Ah, uh, so here we are, camp. Gotta love it. What is today? It's January. 6th of January. Believe. Reminiscing of a season with a lot of success and one failure. <laughs> <laughs> Happened to be mine. I'm pointing the camera right at the failure. Just focused on the wrong things all season. Just focused on shooting a big buck. And sometimes you forget to enjoy the good moments, fellowship with your friends. Yeah. Dude, you sound ridiculous. Yeah, that was stupid. But in all seriousness. But in all seriousness, we don't. Focus <laughs> on one <laughs> specific animal or big box or big elk or huge moose. <laughs> <laughs> well, what is it, January 21st? Yeah. And maybe a little early, but we're hoping that with a couple of short cold spells and this deer being older, that maybe the old antlers popped off quick. And want to get in there before a couple guys that we know that also aren't in the same area get in there. They're retired and they can go any day. So, and they found his last year, so we'd like to be on the better end of it this time and maybe catch him a little early, save each other the trouble of looking around. So, this is kind of where I shot deer last year and the old laurel buck, Let's see if we find him. Well, there wasn't any snow on the ground when we left. We got it to these little higher elevations and it's a winter wonderland. Make it really easy to find them. Yeah, right. <laughs> got a good one. I'm waiting for you. Well, just found the First shed of 2023. Um, waiting for Mikey to get here before I walk up to it. I think it might be his, uh, I don't know, it might be a buck. Uh, he doesn't have uh, pictures of. Well, I'm sure he probably does, but it's not, it's not a giant, but it's a nice buck. <laughs> there should be. Give him the middle finger. I get to keep this one. It ain't the. I said I get to keep this one. It ain't your. It's a nice buck, but is it? I don't know what it is. I'm waiting for you. I'm seeing if you got pictures of them. Sure you do. It's not a giant, but it was. Fuck! I, I saw it and I go. I thought it was a pine branch. I'm going. Ah, that ain't no dang shed. Sure enough, shed. Heck yeah. Right there. Nice. Heck yeah. Keep it. Oh, that's a good that's one. That's fresh man. too. Man, that's, look how, that thing's got some mass to it. Some that's mass. Some mass. <laughs> some mass. Let's look for the other one. How about that? Yeah, it, yeah, it looks like it's just. Man, that thing's heavy. A nice deer. Let's see that little bugger. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> that, I don't know what deer that is. Yeah. No idea. Cool. Let's see if we can find the other one real quick. Yeah. I don't think so. See. This tines. Let me see. Well, it broke up, broke a little bit, but I don't know. I don't think so. I don't know. No. Are you sure? I don't know, man. This I think that's look him. At the, look at the G3. The, I think the G3 on this one's maybe not. I think it's him. I don't know if I got another picture of it. Well, we're back. Successful first attempt. Yeah. Didn't find the laurel buck, but nope. It's still early, but did find yeah. one. Got this one. I got pictures of that deer, and it's a deer I had on hammer last the last year too. So yeah, yeah, that's a good yeah, one. That's a big deer, but that would have been really tough to. <laughs> yeah, body wise and age wise, uh, that's tough deer to pass up. Five-year-old deer. Yeah, I'd say at least for so. sure. Um, but yeah, we're gonna head back and uh, 
try it again when the snow melts. But sure. we're definitely going to hit this again because this was super fresh. The wax ring is still on it. So we'll come back, try to find the other side of this. There's a couple other really big bucks in here that, that Mike East had pictures of. So we're going to try to get them. Uh, so uh, come back with us next time. Well, I just walked right over one. Mikey picking up my slack. Says it's a pretty good one. So we're going to go check her out. Huh? Geez, I walked, I literally walked right over that thing. Oh, yeah. Nice, dude. I walked right past that. That's a good one. Yeah, baby. That's nice. Yeah, that's that's nice. gonna be a real nice one. Well, the other ones, I mean, it's been off for a while. So yeah. That's pretty bleached. That's worth coming up the hill to hunt. For sure. Heck yeah, man. Good job, buddy. First one of the year for me. One of the bucks I was looking for. I'm, I'm almost sure, but. Ah. He did it. These guys are just ahead of me, and we just go speak to me, Dave. And I think we may have found them. <laughs> the freaking guy did it to me again. I was right beside me. You son of a gun, you. Awesome. 100%. Well, have a nice, see. buddy. Hold on. See. Oh, yeah. Pick him up. There he is, old Dave. I can't see. Heck yeah, bud. Oh, there's another one. You get it? No. Nope. Bray, oh. come on. How Don't tease you, us like that. That's a hundred percent him. Oh yeah, dude. That's a. Ow. It's a good one. Right. Good right. job, buddy. I'm blind. Blinded by the light. Sweet. Dude, that's that's awesome. Yeah. Like, that's literally one of the ones we were coming in here looking for, and Anybody I just happened to look that way. Go boop right there. So hopefully the other ones is around here. And this is the smaller of the two that we're so, looking yeah, for. Yeah, yeah. You gotta find the big one. This is Imposter Dave, actually. He found the real Dave. Yeah. Cool. Well, let's find the other Here, side, let's bro. Take a, let's take a picture for Danny Boy. Okay. I can't see. Well, I've been walking quite a ways. Um, I'm in the area where I just found a deer that I, long story short, named Dave, but it's, Dave was actually a deer from the year before, so now I call him Impasta Dave, at least for now. But I'm not sure if this is it, but I just happened to make one good turn felt in my... I don't know, it was weird, I just felt like maybe this is the, finally the right turn. Literally five steps later I looked down and saw at least a pretty good one here. So let's take a look. Decent one. Uh, <laughs> no idea what deer that is. So, uh, not in pasta, Dave. I'm in the area. Felt like this is maybe pretty good. I'm gonna just take another quick look around here. Maybe I'll find another one. So, up to number three for the year, baby. this hill where I found a good one about a month ago when Jason and I were in here and we just we had I knew I had to come back and look and finally I think I got a pretty good one over here I'm gonna try and zoom in I don't know if 
you can see that yet, but heck, I can't even see it on the video here. Where is that thing? Wasn't there it is? Jeez, I'm losing my mind. That's a pretty decent one. So let's let's take a walk up here. Hopefully. I have a feeling this is going to be the other side of that deer that I found already, which is pretty cool. Yeah. That's an old one. Jeez. Well, hey, better than nothing here. Decent guy for sure. Well, keep looking here and hope we find a couple more. This is a, definitely a spot where you're gonna find some if you look hard enough. This is our last scouting trip before uh, turkey season actually gets in full swing. So we're gonna go out and check a spot out. It's got a lot of different age cuts. And, uh, not the greatest access, at least we think. We're, that's kind of what we're doing is checking the gates and making sure you know, some of the, a lot of these roads are going to be blocked off in season, so you can't get a lot, a lot of traffic in there. So we're going to go check that out, and fingers crossed we pick up some sheds or something and uh, find a few spots for some stands. Well, going on a little scouting trip. Uh, what's the date? April 13th? No, uh, 16th. 16th? Oh, I never know what day it is. No, you don't. <laughs> But we're doing a little scouting. There's a big couple big clear cuts on top of this hill, and we figured we'd uh, do one last hurrah for the sheds. And uh, on the way up there, and happened to run into one. Not a real big one, but it's all right. Oh, oh it's been looks like it's been laying there for a little while, but it's a good one. Good enough. Yeah. Got a dead one over here. That's a odd. Is this a big buck or a tiny baby buck? It's one he would shoot. <laughs> uh, gun season buck for you. It's an odd position for one to be in. It's like he f might have fell out of a tree or something. Yeah. Nose dive. Oh yeah. Little baby buck. Little baby bucker. That stinks. That stinks. Literally. Oh, you smell it? No. Alright. Well, we got our ragtag crew out here today there's old bray doing a little shed hunting today on the property in sure grove and we found a deadhead it has been spotted pretty decent buck we're gonna go take a look at it that's your seven point you're just talking about remember you said the seven point on the allenson Oh no. Oh, it's got a flyer. Oh, sorry, babe. It's got a flyer on it right there. That's pretty cool. Oops. Oh, I don't know why it just quit recording for some reason, but it's going now. But it's a pretty good one. We're going to go find some more, hopefully. A little flyer off the side there. Pretty neat. Good job walking, babe. Let's go. Well, I didn't have my, I didn't have my camera with me today. I uh, thought I'd take a quick 
look for a, a 10 point. We were hunting in Sugar Grove here and uh, I got it. At least one side. We'll see if we can find the other real quick. But freaking nice buck, buddy. Heck yeah. There should be. That is a good one for Sugar Grove. Heck yeah. See if I can find the other one here real quick. Okay. Well, looking for the other side of a big buck we found the other day and got an older one. Been sitting a while, but gonna take it. What do you think, bud? We're cool. gonna find a big one? Yeah. Yeah. Hey guys, uh, thanks for watching the video. I just wanted to wrap up our season here. Um, had a pretty good year. Uh, found everything basically from this side over. This one over. Uh, were public land sheds. Um, this one I found a little later when I was scouting and really good find, but um, you know, started out this season not quite as great, but uh, that's what it is in shed hunting. You gotta work and walk and you know, it's kind of cool, you know, that this one right here, actually Jason shot the deer this year and my other buddy, uh, Tim, actually shot and got this one. So, won't be finding, well, this one you might find, but other than that, you know, it was a really good season. We're hoping this one's going to be just as good and, you know, just got to get out there and keep walking and find the sheds. Yep. So. I don't have anything to add to that, Mike. Well, that's good. All right. <laughs>